let's just have a look. Before I go too much closer, I just want to see why she's staring as intently as she is, first of all. And also, she was making a funny face. She stopped it now. Ah. No, she's still looking very intently off in that direction. What's up, girl? What have you seen? Again, the wind is starting to... Look at that. What's going on? Maybe just a burr caught in her lip. Or zebra have some kind of secret language that we are only just now seeing evidence of. Because that looks like she's signaling to another zebra. What is that about? Might just be something uncomfortable caught in her lip or in her teeth. You see the way her top lip is moving like that? And she is still staring off intently. Now her little one's doing it. Now the foal's doing it. Those of you who are familiar with horses, is there something really um, obvious that I'm missing? Is this a, a sort of a common occurrence that horses do? Because, of course, zebra are relatively similar to horses. Now she's running. What's going on? What on earth? I'm just stopping, I'm settling far from them because I just want to try and work out what is going on or what is happening. There seem, oh, she's snorting now, oh, there's got to be something here. And see the way the little foal's legs are splayed? Like it's, it's run and then it's stopped because it's not quite sure which direction to run in. What if she smelt something? No, she's talking to other zebra. I can hear other zebras snorting off to the right of me. Did she get separated, maybe, from the rest of the group? Oh. That's a mystery. The fall's also doing it. Maybe it's just the response in wind. And the reason I ask some of you if you are more familiar than I am with horses, perhaps this isn't a reaction to the wind in some way. That sort of lifting of the top lip. I don't know.